I have known people that are so vitally alive. They grasp life. They go towards living their days in ways that others don't. They're fully alive. And in that, they're a hero to me. They're a hero to life itself. Well, I pray as you enter 2017 that you're fearless. I pray that you're undaunted. I pray that you are victorious. I pray that you are a hero in the field of life. In 1 Peter 4, verse 14, it says, The Spirit of glory and of God rests upon you. Take that on right now. I pray that you feel the Spirit of glory and of God resting upon you. I pray that it infills you. I pray it thrills you. I pray that it gets you ready for more life in 2017 than you've lived in a long time. I pray that you are a hero at life. The dictionary defines hero as a figure of divine descent endowed with great strength or ability, admired for his or her achievements and noble qualities. Did you know that definition defines you? And if it doesn't yet, it will. Because you are going to go beyond where you have been before. You're going to grasp life. You are God's own creation. A spiritual being par excellence. And you're endowed with unlimited potential and capability. You are developing and expressing your divine identity to a greater degree each day and each year. You celebrate your true self and you make this year, 2017, a year to fully know and grasp who you really are. You see any feeling of hesitation or being timid banished forever in the light of spiritual glory. You're unmasking your fears and you are carrying a high banner of your power and your God-given ability to become more. This year is your year to claim your birthright and to exercise your spiritual mastery. You know for yourself in every circumstance you are fearless and you're undaunted, you're victorious, and you're becoming a hero in the field of life.